What's up ladies and gentlemen of YouTube? I'm John from Deadland Steamworks. I've been a daily vlogger for about a month now, except for Sundays. But in that time, I have learned a few things. Yesterday I gave you guys three tips and today I'm gonna show you three apps that I use on my phone that make my life so much easier. first app that I would like to talk about is Google Keep. It's also called Keep Notes now, but it's Google Keep and it integrates with Google Docs so you can go on the computer and you can get into your Google Drive and use Google Docs there too. But this app on my phone is the handiest thing ever. I use this app almost every day to keep notes, lists, if my wife wants me to go to the store, I can just click this little checkbox right here and I can put her grocery list in here. I can get milk, I can get eggs, I can get bacon, whatever it needs to be, you can put it in a list. And then when you get that item and put it in your shopping cart while you're at the store, you reach up here and you just check off the milk or just check off the eggs. And it goes down to the bottom, slashes it out and makes it kind of handy to keep, keep track of it that way. The second app that I want to talk about is Legend. Now I know a lot of people like the animated text in their videos and, and the end cards of my videos are generally done with Legend, but it's a really simple way to animate text and that sort of thing. And all you have to do is open up the app and type something in. We're just gonna go with this, the shorter, the better thing that they've given me and we're gonna hit play on it. And it will show you different animations and different animation options that you can then scroll through. And as you pick different animations or colors or whatever, uh, it'll update the screen and show you that new animation. Now what I like to do is I like to keep the background either black or white, just a solid. And then on the computer, whenever I'm editing in Adobe Premiere, you can overlay that text over your video and key out those colors real easily so that you just have that floating text right there in the screen without a whole bunch of extra stuff. In fact, let's put some right here over this video. I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna put in some uh, subscribe to my channel, hit play. I'm gonna do white over black and let's just do my favorite one here which is the second one. There's a ton of animations in here you can get blinky stuff, splash stuff, you know, it can do like where it has like a letter over the top of it. There's some like weird white block thing that, that it can do. You can do all kinds of stuff. But my favorite two, my favorite one, I should say, is the second one here where it has the little lines that swipe it in because that one's real easy to key out and I can use that over the video like I'm doing right here. I'm doing that just, I'm gonna take this text and just boop right right here you go over here to the little uh, download icon you can go save as video and then I have mine set up to save in 1080p that's the largest resolution that you can get out of it which is great because it still scales to 4k just fine now we have some animated text that we can throw up on our video and have some of those sweet just textual overlays now that's that's pretty simple this is not by the way a sponsored video and this is not a tutorial video on how to use these apps I'm just bringing them to your attention in case you didn't know about them already I'm trying to keep this video kind of short too the third app that I want to show you guys that I cannot live without I make most of my thumbnails using this app it is called snapseed you can just edit your photos right on your phone pop them out to Instagram just oh look phone banger just IG banger, just bam, right there. Super easy to do, super easy to like, you know, right there, it's just right there. So we're gonna pop over here, we're gonna open a photo. Here's one of my son being kind of crazy that I took this morning. He's actually mad at me because I wanted him to sit down and smile for me, didn't work out. But there's a bunch of presets here at the bottom. You can scroll through those, you just click on them and it will sample them for you. Just kind of, just, you know, run through here accentuates one that I like to use once in a while we're gonna try that one out bam right there you hit the check and it takes it and it's done 
Next, we can go over to the tools and there's all kinds of stuff you can do. Let's just click on drama. We're just gonna have some fun with this. These aren't gonna be good edits. I'm not trying to edit like the best thing ever here right now. Like I would normally spend some more time, but this is just a demonstration for you guys. So we're gonna go to drama. And if you scroll up and down, swipe your thumb up and down, you can get access to some options and then swipe left and right to manipulate those options. I hate this one, so we're gonna just hit cancel. But what we do need to do is we can click on portrait here and there are different options here. Let's just click on, let's try spotlight one. No, let's go back to eyes one. I like the eyes one. You have the face spotlight, the skin smoothing and the eye clarity. Let's just crank that up just a bunch and make it look wildly silly. And we'll hit okay and it will apply that edit to your photo. And then we'll go back over here and I wanna add a vignette. So I'm gonna scroll up to outer brightness and we're gonna just darken out those edges just a little bit and ta-da. Now, whenever we're ready to be done with this one, we can go up here to the top, oh, sorry, export at the bottom and we hit save. Or you can share directly from the app. If you guys are interested in being a content creator and you don't use these three apps, you are shortchanging yourself. You need to get on this. You need to use these apps. They are super handy. Lifesaver apps for me, they save a massive amount of time. I use all three of them every single day. And if I'm not wrong, I think all three of these are available on all like Android and iOS devices. I have an iPhone 8 and it, all three of them work on there and all of them work on my Google Pixel 2. So anyway, if you like this content and want to see more of it, make sure you hit subscribe. Smash that like button. I need those likes so we can get me up in the YouTube algorithm. I need my channel to blow. Anyway, I appreciate you guys hanging out with me for a few minutes, and I will see you all in the next video. Peace.